Summer is here, and the 12 Mini deal just got even hotter. The iPhone 12 Mini is now one penny with a two-year contract. Visit an Appalachian Wireless retail location or go to AppalachianWireless.com to view this amazing deal. We are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. As a result of flash flooding that occurred Monday, Pike County residents may be wondering when cleanup services will reach their homes. Tuesday, we spoke with Kentucky Transportation Cabinet Information Officer Sarah George about damage and cleanup efforts in the days to come. So what our crews are doing today is they're going to the places that had high water yesterday and they're checking all the culverts and the drains and cleaning them out as they go and the ditch lines as much as they possibly can. There are a lot of places to cover, a lot of places to get to. So um, people just need to be patient and realize that we are going to get there eventually. Although no roads are known to be impassable at this time, George encourages those traveling to use caution as rain from Hurricane Ida makes its way to Kentucky. It only takes a few inches of water to pick your vehicle up and move it, and then you've lost control. Best advice, of course, is when you see water over the road, do not drive through it. There may not be a road underneath it. The Kentucky Transportation Cabinet continues to monitor conditions and reminds those traveling to turn around, don't drown. For Mountaintop News, I'm Joel Cordial.